come from a land from a faraway place where the caravan camels roam. It's all flat and immense, and the heat is intense. It's a furnace, but hey, it's home. When the wind's from the east, and the sun's from the west, and the sand and the glass in the right, come on down, step on by, hop a carpet, and fly to another Arabian night. Arabian to Agaba, city of enchantment, where every beggar has a story and every camel has a tale. The big day has finally, finally arrived, and we are all just in time to join the festivities. Yes, friends, today is the day we finally find out who Princess Jasmine's future husband will be. While we wait for the royal family to take their places in the royal box, let's get the mood straight. You! Who, me? What's your name? Aladdin. Is there anything you want to say to all the nice people out there, Aladdin? I'm hungry, I'm miserable, and my life is like one bad dream. Thank you. Vizier, the local crime rate is plummeted? No kidding! Jafar, Jafar, any predictions about Princess Jasmine's future husband? No contest! Jafar, Jafar, any truth to the rumor you like to thought in your stuff one day? No comment! Oh, I come from a land where intrigue is the styles and adventures that is full. Where the dogs of the sled hold your head up and smile. It's the wrong! Did I make it? No! Beautiful. 
you know that? You tell her, sister. Jasmine, I am not just your father. I am Sultan, and we all have rules to obey. He has a point. And our final contestant is the prince, formerly known as the artist. <laughs> Thank you. 
of bread. Gee, I don't know. A cute hunger pang, lightness of head, rude growling noises from the stomach, all of the above. Hunger pains? What's that? You're not from around here, are you? Of course I'm from around here. No, you're too nice. And too scared. Well, of course I'm scared. Those people chasing us were so angry. That's Agrabah. Hungry and angry. But when you're trapped here, you get used to it. Believe me, you're not trapped. You're free to go anywhere you want. Do anything you want. Tell me the truth. This is your first time in the marketplace, isn't it? Well, it's my first time in this particular marketplace. It's the only marketplace we have. Oops. So you don't want to tell me where you're from. Fine. But I bet wherever it is, well, it's got to be boring. Beautiful. Wow, the palace looks amazing from here, doesn't it? Yeah, it's always perfectly wonderful. Imagine what it'd be like to live there. No worries, never hungry. And all those servants. And the servants of the servants. Cool. So cool, someone always telling you where to go and who to see. Uh, well, that's how I'd imagine it would be. Yeah, well, I think I can handle it. Not if you were free to live your own life. You're not going back to wherever you came from, are you? Not if I can help it. If I do, that's all. My father will force me to get married. Force you? Whoa. And to someone I don't even know. You shouldn't have to do that. Exactly. Exactly. So, how come you can understand the way I'm feeling? And not the people who actually know me? Maybe they don't see you the way, the way, um. The way? The way I do. This way! This way! See, Sim, you're going straight to the dungeon, kid. He didn't do anything. Run! My, my, my. Who's your pretty young friend? Let him go now, by order of the princess. Princess Jasmine? Princess? Let him go now. That's an order. Your Highness, what are you doing outside the palace and with this riffraff? He's not riffraff, he's Aladdin. How you doing? <laughs>
could choose a husband within the time allotted. The Sultan's highest ranking that official. That would be you. Let me finish. Sultan's highest ranking official, that would be me, immediately becomes becomes betrothed to the princess and himself inherits all the rights, privileges, and powers of the Sultan. So now, all we gotta do is make sure she doesn't fall for anybody before tomorrow. And if she doesn't make sure he has a freakish, tragic accident. A freakish, tragic accident. As you wish, my sultan to be. As I wish. But if things have ever been as I wish. In my formative and hungry years, I was unappreciated by my peers. As their slings and arrows flew, I would ponder, wouldn't you? Why me? Why me? For a man of your charisma. Why is my status always quo? Why does no one want to know? Who are me? Why me? Why am I so unable to fulfill my true potential? Cats down the road will In consequence, what does it take to catch a break? Shoot! Come on, kid. Let's 
it going to be? Cash, camels, casbahs. Huh. You must want something. Hey, what'd you say your name was? Uh, Aladdin. Aladdin, he speaks. OK, this is going to be a snap. May I call you Al? You know, Al, you're a lot smaller than my last master. Either that or I'm getting bigger. Do these hair pads make me look fat? <laughs> Wait a minute. I'm your master? Hello, giraffe of the lamp. It's the genie with the light brown hair. So I like it to make a wish and everything. Yeah, I don't like three wishes. Awesome. But no wishing for more wishes, OK? Because that was just so yesterday. But otherwise, you're the boss. This is your lucky day. All your dreams are coming true. Maybe I should explain? Fine. Maestro, what key are we in? It's a musical! <laughs> well, Alibaba had them 40 themes. You heard Zod had a thousand tales. But Mr. Yor in love cuts up your sleeve. You got a brand match never fails. You got some power in your corner now. Some heavy ammunition in your camp. You got some punch. Possess Yahoo and House. You only got to do is rub their lamp. And I'll say, Mr. Aladdin, sir, what will your pleasure be? It's a big musical. <laughs> Let me take your heart and jot it down. You ain't never had a friend like me. No, no, no. Life is your restaurant, and I'm your bitch, your bee. Come on, whisper what it is you watch. You ain't never had a friend like me. Yes, sir, we pride ourselves on service. You're the boss, the king, the shop. Say what you wish, it's your tradition. I got a little more about the bar. We do realize. 
choice when it comes to air travel. Not. So thank you for choosing Magic Carpet Airlines. We hope you enjoyed your flight. Bye bye now. Goodbye. Watch your head now. Goodbye. <laughs> ha! You thought I couldn't get us out of that lousy cave. Yeah, genie old boy. You sure showed me. Now about my three wishes. <laughs> three? Did I hear someone say three? Yes, your master just did. Actually, you're down to two wishes, mister. No, actually, I still have three, because I never actually wish to get out of that cave. No, just to... You're bad. <laughs> He's bad. You're good. OK, let's get down to it. I want to be a prince. A girl again? <sighs> so wish it already. You mean it? You can really make me a prince? Not until you wish it. All right then, Jeannie. I wish for you to make me a prince. You're sure? I'm sure. You're sure you're sure? Make me a prince. Why sure? <laughs> Oh! 
elbows galore with the bears as lions, his breast hands afar, his forty fakers, his books and fakers, his purse of war, but love me, make war. Shot. And this time, and this time, maybe I'll be Sultan instead of a prince. Or maybe I'll be. What's higher than Sultan? That's not what I meant, Al. Well, I'm a master, and you have to do whatever I say. <coughs> yeah, obeying master, this is a great gig. What a kick! <laughs> but if the princess doesn't want me as a prince, what am I supposed to do? Well, you could always try being yourself. But. Be yourself. That's the last thing I want to be. I wish, I wish, I'm waiting. OK, I need some advice. If you had three wishes, what would you wish for? Well, I'd only need one wish, because I only want one thing.
what's that? To be free. You are free. Yeah, free to be ordered around by anyone who happens to come across my lamp. As long as I'm wearing these shackles, I'm definitely not what you call free. Oh, well, cheer up. Maybe I'll fix that for you as soon as we get the princess to notice me. Yeah, right, Pinocchio. <laughs> I just need to get some time alone with her. Come on, Jeannie. Prince Ali's got a new plan. <laughs> Show you the 
And that's the only offer. 